Boeing 777X, the latest and largest ever twin-engine aircraft by Boeing sets new standards in commercial aviation. Representing the newest addition to Boeing's illustrious 777 family, this series comprises various models, including the 7788, 779, 7710, and the luxurious BBJ 777X. The huge plane boasts unique folding wingtips and next-generation engines that help greatly reduce fuel burn, making it a popular option for airlines like British Airways and Emirates looking to replace less efficient widebodies. But now, what is the story behind the development of the Boeing 777X, a family of long-range, wide-body, twin-engine jet airliners that was first announced in 2013 and has undergone significant design and technological advancements since its inception, including the introduction of new composite materials and improved engines. Inception and Evolution The genesis of the Boeing 777X dates back to 2011 when Boeing embarked on a mission to develop a next-generation twin-engine aircraft. Initially envisioned in three variants, the 777 7778, and 7778 liters R, the aircraft aimed to replace their predecessors while competing with the Airbus A350 family. However, as market demands evolved, Boeing streamlined its lineup to focus on the 7779 and 7778 variants. Notably, the 777X program significantly boosted in 2014 when Emirates placed a monumental order for 150 aircraft. Boeing's commitment to innovation extended beyond the aircraft itself to the creation of state-of-the-art production facilities. In 2014, construction commenced on a groundbreaking factory spanning over 360,000 square feet in St. Louis. This colossal facility serves as the epicenter of 777X production, housing cutting-edge machinery and assembly lines to manufacture and assemble the aircraft's components with precision. Engine Selection Boeing carefully considered engines from giants like Rolls-Royce, General Electric, and Pratt & Whitney for 777X. Due to its superior performance and efficiency, the General Electric GE9X engine, General Electric's largest engine fan, was chosen. These engines, the world's most powerful, deliver 110,000 pounds of thrust, offering 10% improved fuel efficiency compared to the GE90s, while also reducing NLX and noise emissions. Boeing made significant 777X design improvements, but kept several features the same. The new 777s will keep their metal fuselages instead of the 787 and a 350s carbon composites. The most unique aspect of the 777X is its wing design. These carbon composite wings are 71.75 meters long. This offers aerodynamic efficiency, wing flex, and significant fuel savings. The folding wingtips are the wing's most notable feature. Like previous models, the 777 6.9-meter folding wingtips lower its wingspan from 71.75 to 64.85 meters. The 777X can suit regular Code E airport specs and not Code F gates like the A380. Thus, airports won't need to remodel gates. Market Dynamics The market for the 777X was clearly defined before 2020, originally positioned as a replacement for aging four-engine aircraft like the A340, 747, and A380s, the 777X garnered significant interest from airlines worldwide. However, the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic disrupted the aviation landscape, leading to a reassessment of fleet strategies and a slowdown in demand for high-capacity aircraft. Despite these challenges, Boeing remains optimistic about the long-term prospects of the 777X, emphasizing its cost advantages and suitability for diverse route networks. The launch of test flights marked the completion of years of meticulous design and production. In 2020, the inaugural 777X aircraft took to the skies over Seattle for its maiden flight, lasting for four hours. Subsequent test flights further validated the aircraft's performance and safety, paving the way for the next phase of development. After completing successful test flights, Boeing requested certification for the 777X and two additional units were built in 2021, with certification originally planned for late 2021, but was delayed due to the pandemic. Delays and challenges When Boeing announced the 777X, it placed the delivery date in 2018 or 2019. However, early testing problems disturbed the program. 
to focus on the 737 MAX and 787, Boeing slowed development in the mid-2010s. Technical issues plagued GE9X engine development and structural testing. The first flight was delayed from 2016-17 to 2019. Airlines didn't like these changes and moved orders to modernize fleets. The worst issue was 779's fuselage tearing apart during a stress test in September 2019. The first test flight was delayed until 2020 because of this. 777X pilots are avoiding triggering another December 8 catastrophe. 777X's first deliveries are unclear. Boeing discontinued the 8LX and reduced the 777X to 2 by 2013. Insufficient demand for the initial 200 liters R and future orders likely caused this. Only Singapore Airlines ordered 7A350 to 900 ULRs. Lufthansa ordered 34 779s in September after the 777X was introduced in 2013. After that, Etihad, Cathay Pacific, and other airlines pledged billions to the project. Emirates' $56 billion contract for 150 777Xs in July 2014 was the biggest boost. Current status and future outlook As of now, Boeing has most recently said the 777X should enter service in 2025, while Emirates President Tim Clark has said that he thinks the 777X is probably at the back end of next year and maybe 2026 if we're unlucky. This would mean that Boeing would deliver the first 777X six years after the initially planned delivery date. That timeline has been pushed back considerably, so do we have any reason to believe that this is at all realistic? Although deliveries don't start anytime soon, airlines are still committed to the plane. There are currently over 450 orders for the 777X. With its unmatched range and fuel efficiency, the Boeing 777X will definitely change aviation. With a range of 8,730 nautical miles and 384 seats, the 777X is the ultimate of technology and comfort. Now after all these years, do you think the 777X will ever enter service at all? Definitely let us know in the comments. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates. Thanks for watching.